Princeton University, NJIT, and Camden County College are hosting regional academic tournaments in the New Jersey Science Olympiad. Middle school and high school students put both knowledge and teamwork to the test in events that run the gamut from chemistry to robotics. Science and technology correspondent Patrick Regan takes us to the games. The framework for the Science Olympiad is an international effort to improve education, keep young people excited about what they're learning, recognize their achievements, and open their eyes to a world of future career opportunities. Locally, it takes lots of preparation by students and their schools. Events are aligned with state science education standards and all kinds of support from major companies, universities, and organizations like the R&D Council of New Jersey and the Science Teachers Association. Like athletes, students show themselves to be both good sports and tough competitors, but the field for their matchups may be mechanical engineering, robotics, or in this case, environmental chemistry. They actually have two lab portions where they have to do a soil analysis and also a soil classification. And apart from that, they also have a written portion of the test. Events such as elevated bridge building can integrate lessons about physics and materials science with important principles of engineering and design. There's always a compromise. In everything that is designed, there's always a compromise. For example, you can have an incredibly strong bridge that holds 30 kilograms, but we're only testing to 15 anyway. And the way you win is by having the lightest bridge that holds the most weight. Just the chance to meet professional scientists and engineers and to work in a university research laboratory like this one, where high school teams are doing acid-base chemistry, can change the way students see themselves and their options. We look at uh, the people, the, the students here, as, as you know, the, the future of, of uh, uh, technology for the United States and for, certainly for New Jersey. And we're really trying to encourage them to pursue a career ultimately in science. There's evidence right here that this approach can work. I've actually competed in previous science Olympiads when I was in actually in high school. Patrick Regan, NJN News, Princeton.